And at what point did you find out that you were in trouble? The point where I saw a police officer and the principal. They came into your classroom? Yes, and they, they took me out. I got all my stuff. They said, get your stuff, come out with us, and then where'd you go? I went to an interrogation room which filled with four other officers. An interrogation room in your school? Uh, it's a school resources room. I call it the interrogation room because that's where I got interrogated. So they put you in a chair and there's, there's five officers total and the principal. Did you ask them, can I talk to my parents, can I call my parents and tell them what's going on? Yes. And what did, yes. they, what did they say? They, were, they told me, no, you can't call your parents. You're in the middle of an interrogation at the moment. And what kind of things did they ask you? They asked me a, a couple of times, is it a bomb? And I answered a couple of times, it's a clock. And that didn't seem to satisfy them? No. How long were you in that room? About an hour, 25 minutes, an hour, around an hour and 25. So, so what else were they asking you aside from is it a bomb if you were in there for an hour and a half? They asked me why, why, why I would bring a clock to school and I had explained to them that I brought it to school to show my teachers to impress them. So eventually, after an hour and a half, that, is that when they handcuff you? Yes. Did they say you're under arrest or you're being charged? They told me I was under arrest and I asked them for what crime. And they were like, for a hoax bomb. How'd you feel? I felt, I felt like I was a criminal. I felt like I was a terrorist. I felt like all the names I was called. What do you mean all the names you were called? Um, I was called, um, in middle school, I was called a terrorist, called a bomb maker, just because of my race and religion. Wait, you've been called that before by, by just by kids in your school? Yes. And were the officers saying things like that to you? One of the officers did comment on me walking in the room. What did he say? He got back in the recline chair and he relaxed and he was like, and he said, that's who I thought it was. And what did you take that to mean? I took that to mean that he was pointing at me for what, uh, what I am, my race. And he took it, he took it at me because I was a, um, I was just a student that I never, I never had any contact with him. I never talked.